Pakistan has got its first helium miner, in fact two of them, and in this video I'll share important details about those hotspots. Hey folks, this is Roy and welcome back to my channel, Eigentech. Alright, let us jump into the Helium Explorer map. For that, go to your favorite browser and type explorer.helium.com slash coverage. Currently, there are about 76,900 hotspots in the whole world. Uh, we'll just drag to Asian countries here and you can see there is one green dot here. If you click on it, you can see that there are actually two hotspots located in Lahore, Pakistan. Uh, if you like to measure the distance between them, you can click here and here while turning on the ruler button and it shows you it's about 570 meters apart. Now we'll click on the first one and check on the hotspot details. So you can see it's located in Lahore, Punjab, Pakistan, completely synced, but it is relayed. Uh, let us check the activity tab and you can see that the hotspot was added on 2nd of July. The location was also asserted on the same day and it actually synced very quickly within one and a half days and uh, then started um, mining activity here and then let's go back here and click on the other hotspot and check its details again so this is called clean amber pheasant and again this is also synced but relayed and on the activity tab you can see it has uh, it was added in the blockchain on 3rd of july and the location was was asserted also on the same day now if we go back here uh, we can check one more thing uh, so if you look at the owner here you will see that you will see that these two hotspots belong to the same owner so uh, whoever bought uh, actually somebody must have bought both of them and placed it uh, around 570 meter apart from each other so now the question is so you must be very eager to know which brand are these hotspots so these are actually bobcat hotspots and that brings a lot of questions because earlier i told you that bobcat said they do not have a suitable helium miner for pakistan then how could it be how could there be bobcat miners in Pakistan and will those work so when Bobcat say that they do not have a suitable product that could mean two things first their hardware is not capable of auto switching to 865 MHz or second their hardware is fine but they do not have official permission from Pakistan government that is why they are not claiming that it will work in Pakistan uh, but I checked some other documents and there looks like there is some good news so let us first check this frequency plan of helium so i will share this link in the description and if you just search for uh, pakistan here and you will see that the frequency plan is in865 which means any hotspot working uh, working in pakistan should use 865 megahertz however when i check the, this other document from loda alliance which is the global organization and uh, again you search for pakistan here you will see it pakistan indeed has three frequency bands starting from 433 to 435 megahertz which is european 433 band then this is the important one the 865 to 869 megahertz so 868 is already included in the license free spectrum so uh, anybody can use it so it means that if the bobcat is working at or using 868 megahertz frequency it doesn't need to actually switch to 865 because 868 is already free and uh, that is a good news also uh, there is also 922 925 megahertz so what i think is that any european 868 megahertz can work in pakistan as it is a free band there and in principle uh, in future helium can also decide uh, to use 868 megahertz for pakistan as well and that will be great for pakistan so i think uh, bobcat has a chance that it will actually work in pakistan and it doesn't have to uh, auto switch its frequency to 865 megahertz even if it switches to 865 megahertz that is also fine because 865 is also included in the free band in pakistan hope this information will renew your excitement in helium mining that's all for today thanks for watching guys and get crypto analyzed